Round on Lake Oneida, hooked up on Sunday after the BFL tournament where I had 18 pounds for the win. We're fishing with a drop shot again out in that 9 to 12 foot range. We currently got one here. Let's see if we can get them. Not quite the same class as yesterday, but you can see where that Gamagatsu split shot drop shot hook got him right in the top of his mouth to where you always end up hooking him with that and hard time for him to come off that way so we'll let this one go here and I'll show you some uh, my tackle and rods that I was using so here we we're using the Dobbins it's their champion extreme series it's a DX 702 SF which is their medium action uh, drop shot rod with the hook, like I was showing you before, that buttons them up right in the roof of their mouth is the size two split shot drop shot Gamagatsu. And then I use a Eco Pro full contact uh, drop shot weight here. And I leave with it about a 12 to 14 inch liter. For my reel, you use a Quantum Smoke. It's a uh, fast uh, reel action here. So it helps you catch up with those small, especially when you're fishing out deep, which is going to be great for up at the Oneida Costa. One last thing I want to show you is the line I've been using this week. It's the Seaguar. It's their finesse version of their line. It's 7.3 pounds and it's 100% fluorocarbon. That lighter line is let for uh, more bites and helped definitely catch more fish this week. So when you're up here at Oneida, you gotta be targeting her right now about that nine to 12 foot range. And just looking for different areas that have rock and grass mixed in. So if you have any questions later this week, let me know. Thanks.